Could this robotic rover eventually replace seeing eye dogs? ASU students developed it and impressed judges in Shanghai. We're turning on the robot dog. First thing it does, it stands up. A teddy bear in shades sits in for a blind person. The robot is programmed to watch for obstacles. We specifically looked at traffic lights and cars and uh, like a uh, construction uh, cone. Unsafe to move. There is a car in the road. The students mix software and hardware and artificial intelligence to get the dog to move, detect, and respond. The light is now green. Unlike real dogs, the robots aren't colorblind, and there are other bionic benefits. Normal guide dogs take years to train and a lot of money and time and dedication. This guy doesn't get distracted by cats or need food either. A real guide dog has a limit what we can train, what we cannot. But for our robotic guide dog, we don't see the limit. The sky is the, the, the limit. It can't cuddle or comfort, but the robot helped the student engineers achieve their goal. You just want to make people's lives as easy as possible. So no matter what challenges they have, they can live their lives as normally as anyone else.